Hey, this is Deepak here from digitaldeepak.com and in this video we are going to have a look at Google Data Studio. Data Studio is a free product from Google and it helps you visualize your data. All you have to do is add a data source and this data source can be anything. It can be uh, your Facebook Ads account, Google Ads account, analytics or you can even import data directly from a Google Sheet. So Data Studio has a lot of templates which you can use to create beautiful charts or you can go ahead and create your own template. So let's have a look at gallery. So here you can see there is a gallery of different charts and uh, visualizations that has been created. And let's have a look at few of them. So this looks like a Facebook campaign uh, insights report where you can see the amount spent, CPM, impressions, reach, and a bunch of data like this. And there is also a way to go ahead and uh, change the objective. And you can go ahead and change the campaign name and you can go ahead and change the date range as well. So if you look at this, uh, there is another chart which has been created with a map and there are uh, bar charts and uh, a bunch of data here along with an year selector. So this shows the possibility of what you can do with Google Data Studio. So I have not created any complex reports like this. I have created a very simple report and I will tell you why I have created it and how it is useful for me. So I am inside my Google Ads account and here you can see that I am running a campaign called LDM Leads. So here this LDM leads campaign has a bunch of data in it. So if I want to look at the data of this month, then I'm looking at 1,53 spent, uh, 14 rupees per lead, 40,000 clicks and 11,200 conversions. Now what I can do is that I can go ahead and check last month. And this is the statistics for last month. 1.44 lakh spent, 12 rupees per conversion and again 11,900 conversions. So if I'm inside Google Ads, then I have to go ahead and keep changing the data here if I want to compare last month with this month. So what if there is a way to build a dashboard just like this, but with all the data I need instead of having to access that data each and every time manually. So that is where Google Data Studio comes in. So this is the dashboard that I have created for my own Google Ads account. And here you can see that uh, I have a snapshot of what happened last month. Uh, the total cost per conversion, the total cost, the number of leads. I have a snapshot of what happened this month. The total leads that we have collected, the total uh, money that has been spent and the cost per conversion. Apart from this, I also like to see some other relationships. I want to see how the daily budget is affecting the number of conversions. So this is the chart. So here the blue color is the daily budget and the red line is the number of conversions. I want to see if there is an increase in daily budget is also resulting in increase in cost per conversion. And you can see that there is a correlation. So if the cost goes down, then the cost per conversion also goes down. If the cost goes up, then the cost per conversion also goes up. So you can see that the curves are matching between both these lines, which means that if I put a daily uh, budget, which is higher, then the cost per conversion is also higher because Google is going to increase the CPCs and uh, Google is going to bid more aggressively. So here you can see all the keywords that are driving traffic uh, to my ad campaigns. So I have a snapshot of that here. And here you can see the CTR uh, versus average CPC versus click conversion rate. So I wanted to check if the cost per conversion is higher. Uh, the click conversion rate is also higher. Uh, we cannot say that there is a direct correlation because this is mixed. And here you can see average CPC versus cost per conversion. So if the average CPC increases, then the cost per conversion also increases. There is a definite correlation. And here you can see average CPC versus daily cost. So if the daily budget is uh, higher, then the CPC also is higher. So these are the relationships that I can see. And this is something that I built myself. So if I want to go ahead and edit it, I can click on edit. 
and I can go ahead and uh, change whatever elements I want to change. If I want to change the color of this, I can change. If I want to change the data source, I can change. I can also go ahead and create new charts and uh, I, I can create a date range. I can create a filter control. I can create a data control. So Google Ads uh, data is being displayed here. Uh, the way I want it and here you can see that I have also put daily average conversions and there is a filter here which filters only the LDM leads and also I can go ahead and put a custom data range so here I have put last 30 days as the date range and I can go ahead and put it on auto as well so building a data studio report is beyond the scope of this video in this video we are just having a look at what is data studio and how it can be used for your business so i have created a separate tutorial and i have created a separate course called google data studio mastery which goes ahead and explains how to make the best use of data studio and how to create report for google ads google analytics facebook ads and a lot of different uh, programs so if you want to go ahead, uh, just go ahead, watch a few tutorials and uh, if you have a Google account, then you will also get Google Data Studio along with it. You can go ahead and experiment with it and see the capabilities of it and uh, get comfortable with Google Data Studio because I feel that the power to visualize data is a very big power and uh, you should not be letting it uh, slip from your hands. So this is something very important for a digital marketer and every digital marketer should be data driven, analytical and should have the power to make decisions based on data. So that's about it for this video, Google Data Studio overview. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave a comment below and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.